Welcome, I'm Paul Harrington. I'm the sales and marketing director for Well-Trained Mind Press. And I'm excited to be here today with Kathy Dizloki. That's not right. Dizloki. <laughs> 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 Hi, I'm Paul Harrington, sales and marketing director with Well-Trained Mind Press. And I'm Susan Weisbauer. I'm the owner of Well-Trained Mind Press. And I'm Kathy Diaz-Lucky, founder of Figures in Motion. Well-Trained Mind has acquired Figures in Motion. And Susan and Kathy are going to talk about how we're working together moving forward. Well, you know, here at Well-Trained Mind Press, we are very word and page focused. We're very book centered. Um, and generally our approach to classical education, of course, Well-Trained Mind Press takes its name from the Well-Trained Mind book, uh, which is about a classical education for K through 12. Because classical education is so word focused, sometimes kids who have other learning strengths who need to be more tactile more hands-on who need to just be you know have have more interaction with the material in a way that's not just reading and listening sometimes they can feel a little bit left out and one of the things i've always loved about figures in motion is that it takes you know all of these great people that we write about and we talk about and it gives kids an opportunity to really enact um act with them you know really get in there with their hands and i just think it's such a wonderful opportunity for kids who maybe have a more of a, a a more kinesthetic learning style I'll make it a short story but it started out with an idea that my mom had about making movable figures from the Plymouth plantation around Thanksgiving time and I I took that idea and one evening, I just made a bunch of figures on construction paper. I gave it to my children the next day. They cut out the pieces, they put them together, and they loved them. And they just um, they just played with them for weeks. And so I had an idea years later to um, do the same thing with history. We were studying history and started out in ancient times with a well-trained mind. We loved the books and we loved the stories because I have two boys and one girl and my boys were having a hard time just listening. And they, they love to act out history. And they would take these figures, play with them, tell the stories, learn who the people were in a different way and it just reinfor reinforced their learning. So I, I took that and I actually contacted Susan years ago and she, she was really positive about this idea. And I went forward with it and came out with um, a series of books and we're still working on them. We have books for volume one, two, three of Story of the World and I'm working on the fourth book and uh, we have American history, Civil War history, and I've just had so much feedback from parents over the years of how their children are just engaged and it brings a new dimension for them. It also gets them away from the screens a little bit and they, children who love crafts and storytelling just are delighted with the figures. We have recommended Figures in Motion um, in the Well-Trained Mind, various editions of the Well-Trained Mind for many years. So it's a real delight that we can now take, you know, a, a greater hand in just, uh, you know, getting these, getting these great books out to a wider audience. Famous figures of modern times. And that will, and that will go along with Story of the World, Volume 4. Right, exactly. That's great. And then also, uh, you're doing a, a, a second edition of your dinosaur book. Yes, Dinosaurs on the Move. It has 10, or actually nine articulated dinosaur puppets and one flying reptile. Ooh. And we've had a lot of excitement on the first version of this, too. And there are a lot of paleontologists who were encouraging, you know, and 
thinking that this this is just a great book for kids who love paleontology and dinosaurs. One of the things that we want to uh, get folks, encourage folks to do, is to share uh, photos of their their children uh, using the books, uh, playing with the dolls, making the dolls, um, and uh, they can post those. And that would be, we'll, we'll, we'd love to get those and uh, just to sort of share them on Facebook and whatnot and show how how folks, how kids uh, are, are playing with these and using these books. Thank you all for watching and look forward to more Figures in Motion from Well-Trained Mind. And...